once again. If you haven't drawn, do so right now. Or you start at the back. Forever. There it is. Green light go. Because that in the sixth gate jumps out to the early leave at 99. Olivia Mouse charging right behind as they go into turn three and four. At the line, because Zed will lead lap one. Olivia Mao right in tow. right behind. White flag out for 6K, Carson Kazette. Can he hold off Olivia Mao? We'll see. As they charge into three and four right now, coming out of turn four, here's your winner, 6K, Carson Kazed. With 99, Olivia Mao right behind. Namaste. Green, 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 three wide going into turn one. Xander Coleman gold jumps off to the early lead, but on the high side, Layla Eisenshake powering around out there. Can she hold, get in front? No. Nope. Xander Coleman shuts the door on the high side and will lead lap one. Layla gets underneath and now drives to the lead in the 15L. Amelia Eisenshank now working the high side as well as we have contact into the infield. Goes the 5X to Coleman and Dodgen out on the racetrack. Green, green, green. Back racing. Looking one style here. Amelia Eisenshake now working on Xander Coleman on the high side, trying to go power move. And she gets by for second. Here she does. Now she sets her sights on her sister Layla right now. Can she run her down with a handful of laps remaining? Going into turn three, coming out of turn four right now at the line. It's Layla Eisenshake. Amelia Eisenshake was running her down. 5X Xander Coleman. And the seven of Anna Henderson. Now we got a sister battle for the lead. With just one lap remaining now, white flag out. Amelia goes high into turn one. She's starting to pull up alongside as they go into turn number three. It's going to be a close one at the finish. Who's it going to be? It is Layla Eisenshake with Amelia right there. And the 5X is Xander Coleman on the 7 of Evan Hendrickson. Awesome back. Coming out of turn number four right now, looking for green, and there they get it. Blake Bjorndahl, the Grave Digger special, jumps out to your early lead. Lexi Thromke behind in eight and the 12 of Kate and Gazette in third place. Change that time by Blake Jordan all looking good out in front in the three card as he starts down the back straight away and goes into turn three. Lexi Frosty behind in eight and the 12 of Caden Kazette in third place. Jordan stretching out that lead in the three as he completes yet another lap. Almost a full straightaway advantage over the eight of Lexi Frosty. White flag out, one more lap to go for Blake Bjorndahl in three. Over a straightaway lead now as he charges into turn number three. Here's your winner, number three, Blake Bjorndahl. Number eight, Lexi Promke in second place and rounded out your field. Number 12, Hayden Kazed. Pace their way through turns three and four right now looking for green. Jesse Skalicki points at the green light and it turns on magically and we are racing. Vince Noble jumping out to the early lead in 34. 
He will lead lap number one in 34. Simon Mallow second place in seven. 15 Andrea Jacobson up to third. And 29 Macy Olson in fourth. Simon Mouth starting to catch up here. Leader Vince Noble goes to the high side as they go to turn number three. Right up on that back bumper as they charge into turn three once again. One of me. I don't know where I'm at. Inside turn number four right now there. Simon Mouth takes a look and gets by the 34 of Vince Noble for the lead. New leader time with one lap to go. White flag out for Simon Mao. Mao gets a little high coming off of turn number two, but keeps it away from the outside of the racetrack. But your winner, number seven, Simon Mao. 34, Vince Noble in second place. The 15, Andrea Jacobson in third. And 29M, Macy Olson rounding out your field. Looking for the green light. Here it comes. And here we go. Progressive charges for the lead in the 19. The fly news of Ashton Speaker got inside of second break right now. Contact for third place between Nygaard and 21 and the 18 of Tate Magnuson. Nygaard moves up to third place right now. Your running order looks like this as they're getting a single file. It's Gress at the 19, Flying Deuce, Ashton Speaker in second. 21 of Racing Nygaard and the 18 of Tate Magnuson. Gress up stretching that lead out a little bit in 19. Third of the straightaway advantage over the Flying Deuce. The lap is starting to wind up, but it looks like the Flying Deuce holding strong in second place. Gets a run coming on the 19, going into turn three. Can he close it in? Let's see. White flag, one more time to go. Onto the back bumper. Can't quite make the pass, though. Your winner in 19. Finger up in the air. That's Cole Gress. That's 19. Your winner. Five years action speaker into green. There it is. Green, green, green. Rocco jumps out to the lead. Ryan Brass has got a look at the inside. Could not quite make it stick, though. At the line this time, it'll be Crogro in 10. Brass at 29. 11 of Olsen. Olsen gets a look inside, and he'll take over second place. Now, second place for the dead day, Jacob Crogro. Split up a little high, though, coming out of turn two. Somehow managed to make it stick in the loose stuff. Loose again as he comes out of fourth. Crogro doing a good job up in front right now in 10K. All three starts to win this one. Who's it going to be? We're the lucky ones that get to find this out. White flag one more time around. We'll see who it's going to be. Oh, get the look underneath. Can't quite make it work out there. 10K Jacob Grogro charges into turn three. Goes high. Your winner on the final quarter of the 11 old Toby Olsen. 10K Jacob Grogro. Coming out of turn four. Looking for a green light go. He's been more up to the high side of the start. Almost got a couple of people napping. But your early race leader, 76 Ryan Taylor. Honor Mark Ward, 29, right behind. And Ethan Moore challenging for second place, for or third place, will get that spot from Kai Pitts in 53. Ryan Winter, right behind him in 21. Sleepy Pete in the 76, flying up front. before Ethan Moore jumps up to the second spot. Oh no, we have two laps to see. A lap and a half to go. Does he have what it takes to get up there to the lead? We'll see here. Ken Riley Sailor hold him off. White flag, one more time around. The four cars are down the back bumper right now as they go down the back straightaway going into turn three. Coming out of four right now, who's it gonna be? Riley Sailor. Number four in the race. Coming out of turn four, looking for green. Green, let go. Gerald Noble in 34, your early race leader with the Norminator behind him. But Jim Essenson got by him in the horse. 
seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, now sets his sights, charges into turn three, makes a stick on the bottom. New race leader, Tim Essenson. Got a 34 of Gerald Noble in third place. Noble got off the racetrack on the back side, but made a good save. And that KWE car running last. Right flag out for Tim Estenson. Norm Wilson got a little high, coming up at turn two, makes the save. You're in a row, Tim Estenson, 14 team. Second place that we'll go to, Gerald Noble and Norm Wilson pulls off. Get yourself something nice to keep you hydrated or eat something real good. It's all real awesome. As the green light is on right now, my rookie is your early race leader in the 72. Then it's the B1 of Brody Carlsner, the 6 of Colton Everett, 76 of Gwen Saylor, and the 5 of Toby Brassett. Ty Wilkie still leading right now, but Brody Carlsner takes a look to the inside as they go to turn one. Carlsner jumped the disc out there in the middle of turn number one, and that kind of cost them a little bit. Well, never trying to reel the two leaders in right now as they go into turn three. Carlsner gets a look to the inside as they come down the front straightaway. Your new race leader, B1, Brody Carlsner. 72, Ty Wilkie right behind him, Colton Everett also there, right flag, one zero, last to go. All up, all up on each other's bumpers here as they come on turn number four, who's it going to be at the line? Brody Carlsrud. Olivia Mao jumps out to the early lead at 99. Get that right behind him, six chains. Track's still a little slick after getting some moisture on it. And that takes a look at the inside to go to turn number one and two right now. So he'll be our new leader in 6K, Carson Kazed. Olivia Mao right behind. Laps right, winding down in our second round of heat races. Gazette won the first heat race already in this class. Can he do it again? We'll see here. Check her flag out. Your winner, six days, Carson Gazette. 99, Olivia Mao is second. Rookie one, heat race. Green, green, green. Up front at the door-to-door -door battle right now with Henriksen and Coleman as they go into turn number three right now. Then it's Layla Eisenshank 15, Ellen Amelia Eisenshank 15A. Layla Eisenshank closing in on your leaders as they go into turn three. Still door-to-door -door at the front. Who's going to lead lap number two? We'll see right here. Too close to call from my point of view. Now Layla getting into the mix in the 15. Ellen Amelia starting to reel him in too. All four carts right now in the back of a pickup. Layla takes a look to the inside, almost made it pretty wide, 
going into turn one. Hendrickson, though, is now pulling ahead slightly. They go into turn three, into the grass and around. We got ourselves a little bit of a dinger derby in turn. Layla Eisenshank in the 15A. Oh, Amelia, oh, oh no, sorry, turn that around. 15A. Amelia Eisenshank, and then the 15L of Layla Eisenshank, your top four carts. There it is, green, green, green. 7, Evan Hendrickson, still your leader, 5X, Xander Coleman, second place, looking to the high side, in turn three is Layla Eisenshank. Coleman also looked a little high out there, now the 15L, they're going to be three deep going into turn three. White flag is out, who's it going to be? And now Layla Eisenshank is trying to split them. And the sisters get together again, and around goes Amelia Oh, sorry, uh, Amelia's still running. Yellow flag is out. And oh, looking for green. Green, white, checkered time. Green, light, go. Layla Eisenstein jumps to the high side out there. Kent, she makes a power move, power move on the seven of Evan Hendrickson. She pulls ahead slightly as they come through three and four. And she'll be your new leader as they go into turn one. Half a lap to go in this heat race right now. Your winner will be the 15L of Layla Eisenstein. Second place will go to the 5X of Xander Coleman. I think Amelia. As they come through turn four right now. Green light go. As that in the 12 charges to the lead, but Blake Jordan fights right back in the three. They come through three and four right now. Who's it gonna be at the line? Lexi Fromke joining the party too. At the line. Looks like Jordan got him by just the nose on that front of that go-kart. He'll charge into the lead right now as he comes through three, four, gets a little loose, coming off a of four. Able to hold it, making the great save, and he'll lead lap number two. It's still Bjorndal, Kazed, and Fromke, your top three carts right now. No change that time by. Yeah, Bjorndal now starts to stretch that lead out just a little bit more in the three. The battle for second place between Kazed and Fromke starting to heat up. Lexi Bromke takes a look as they go into turn number one. And not quite make the deal, but looking under again, coming out of turn two. White flag out, one more lap to go for Blake Bjorndal in three. Off the track goes Kazed in 12. Caution is out. We got a green light checkered coming up here. Green light, go. Bjorndal's looks strong so far in the three. Can he hold off the charging Lexi Fromke in the eight? We'll see here as he's got one more lap to go. White flag out. They come through three and four right now. Your winner in three will be Blake Bjorndal. Lexi Fromke number eight in second place. And the 12 of Caden up tight looking for green. Coming out of four. There it is. Green light go. Simon Mao, your leader in seven. 34, Vince Noble right behind. Then it's the 15 of Andrea Jacobson and the 29 of Macy Olson. Mao got a good start in seven. Charges into three and four. Knock and laps around. We have the 29 of AM, but Macy Olson went around. He gets back on, we stay green. At the line again is Simon Mao in seven. Vince Noble 34, 15 to Andrea Jacobson and 29 Emma Macy Olson. That's now going into traffic. Simon Mal goes up into the danger zone out there into the loose stuff. Able to make the pass. Vince Noble gets under the 29 Emma Macy Olson also. Vince trying to track down that seven to Simon Mal as the white flag is out. One more lap to go. Mao gets out of turn two cleanly. Goods into turn number three. Coming out of turn four, your winner, Simon Mao in seven. 34, Vince Noble in second place. 15, Andrea Jacobson in third. 29, M. Macy Olsen in fourth place. Feature race is going as soon as possible. Green light, go. The blind dude, Sebastian, speaker jumps into the lead, but they're three wide going into turn number three. Cole Gresseth coming out in second place on that deal. Nygaard got a little loose in 21, coming off a of turn number two. 
Track's still a little slick right now, but there is going to be a battle for the lead. The blind dude, Sebastian Speaker, is in the lead, but Cole Gretz has all over that back bumper right now. Takes a look inside, and we got them together, and around. Caution out, caution out, wild spin out, turn three right now, looking for green. Race start time, green, green, green. Sebastian Speaker in the blind dude, stretching out a good lead, going into turn number three right now. Brayden Nygaard, second place in 21, Tate Magnuson in 18, now gets passed by the 19 of Cole Gretz. Gretz is charging out there in the 19, setting the sights on the 21 of Brayden Nygaard, gets underneath him, coming out of fourth. Nygaard got loose and went right across the nose. It's remaining in this heat race. The green light's back on, we are back racing. And Ashton Speaker in the lead in the flying deuce, 19 Cole Gresset right behind him in 19. White flag, one more lap to go. Gresset right up on that back bumper of the flying deuce of Ashton Speaker, who's it gonna be at the line? It's Speaker. Ashton Speaker, Blind Dude, your winner. 19 Cole Grant, that's in second place. Braden Nygaard, 20 right now. Looking for green. There it is, green light go. Contact going into turn number one right now. Around goes the 10K of Jacob Progro. And we'll be enforcing that a little bit more often now as the green light comes back on. Colby Olsen charges out in the lead in the 11. 29, Ryan Brass set behind him. And Brogro in the 10 k Brogro makes a move on the high side of the 29 of Brass set for second place. I'll take a look to the inside and go to turn one. Door got slammed shut out of the note. Olsen stretching that lead out in 11. 29 of Rathef in second place in the 10K, and Jacob Progro in third. Olsen now with almost a straightaway lead as he comes out of turn four, seeing the white flag with one more lap to go. Battle is for second place now. Can Rathef hold off the 10K and Jacob Progro? We'll see right here. Here's your winner, 11, Kobe Olsen. Coming in a turn four right now, though. Who's it going to be for second? And Progero in 10. Brass up in 29 right behind. Looks like Pitts will be a scratch for this heat race right now as they go green light racing. Oh, big pile of this. Sleepy Pete got shuffled all the way to the back of the pack at 76. Gets back down to the low line, though. Taking the lead, coming out of turn number two, the Red Rocket, number four, number four, he's in four. That is the 29 of Connor Martin, the 11 of Caleb Kremick, and a battle for it, the back of the pack right now with Riley Saylor getting a little bit of contact out there for the 21 of Prince The Red Rocket, though, jumping up with a big lead in four. Battle for third place right now between Kremick and 11. A little bit of contact out there. White flag, one more lap to go. He has a straightaway lead in the four, and he will win. Even more, number four, Red Rocket. 29, Connor Marquardt in second place in the media. 11 to Caleb Kremick. Riley Taylor sneaking up in the fourth place. Bruce on a turn number four right now, looking for green. There it is, green light go. Of Gerald Noble jumps out to the early lead. Tim Essenson right on him though. Charges in the third number one. Looking at a powerful move out there. It looks like the 53 is a scratch again. Something fell off the back of that pick. Your leader though, 14 T, Tim Essenson. and the 29 of Michael Olsen. Olsen starting to reel in that 34 and Noble. Really out there. Olsen catching up. He's going to do it this time by though. One more lap to go. You're going to go go now. Over a straightaway lead. Your winner for 14T, Tim Essenson.
Coming for second place, who's it gonna be? Noble at 34. And the 29 of Olsen. Drew's Garage Frisbee Toss and the 50-50 drawing. Green light go. Going in at one and two, going on the back straightaway right now. Toby Pitts charges to the lead in three, but goes up high. Who's it going to be the line? Brody Carlson who got that lap in D1, but now Keith Crosby ducks underneath him and gets to the lead in 88. They charge into turn number three right now. It's still Keaton Crosby. That's the one of Carl Brewer, he sticks up Everett, who has a problem close to the infield. Caution out. Green as they come out of turn four, our final heat race of the evening. Back to lead, green flag racing. Eaton Bromke jumps out to the lead in the 88 once again on the restart. And then it's B1, Brody Carlson, there's Colton Everett, six, Toby Brown, that's five, 72, Ty Wilson, and 76, Gwen Saylor. Bromke stretching that lead out in the 88. The next four carts, all right, nose to tail right now. And now Ty Wilkie makes a move to the inside for third place. White flag out, one more lap to go. Half a lap for the 88 to Keaton Bronke. Now he comes out of turn four. Your winner, Keaton Bronke, 88. B1, Brody Carlsrud in second place. So it's the 72 of Ty Wilkie. to get to their places. Patrick, potty mouth, please. a door-to-door -door battle right now, but coming out on the top spot will be the 6K Carson Gazette. Your winner for the 50-50 drawing, $110 going to Amanda Kunze. Blake Bjorndahl's mom, the Grave Digger Special, number three. Congratulations and thank you for playing once again that 50-50. That helps us keep the doors open here, ladies and gentlemen, so we really appreciate you buying as, all the tickets that you do. To racing action, those 6K Carson Cadet continues to lead. Olivia Mao not letting them get away though in the 99. Laps starting to wind down right now. Olivia got a little bit of a run going into turn three. Starting to close that gap as the laps wind down. Who's it going to be here coming up? Olivia Mao starting to catch up to the 6K Carson Cadet as they go into turn number one. Charging down the back straightaway though, because that pulls ahead just a little bit. It's still Kazette in command out front in the 6K. Gets a little high coming out of turn number two. Will that cost them? We'll see. 99 Olivia Mao in second place as they see the white flag. One more lap to go. If you're going to go, go now. Charging down the back straightaway right now. A little bit of a run from the 99. Who's it gonna be coming out of turn number four right now? 6K, Carson Cazette. 99, Olivia Mao in second place. All right, ladies and gentlemen, clap your hands, stomp your feet, make some noise, honk your horns, and tailgating for your winner, number 6K, Carson Kazed.
51's on the racetrack right now. Seven of Evan Henderson gets back up, line him up, tight here, looking for Green. Coming out of three and four right now, looking for Green, here it is. And well, there it is, Green, let go. They're door to door going into turn three right now, Layla Eisenshank will come up, your leader of lap one. Sanders, Holman, Amelia, Eisen, taking the seven of Evan Henriksen. No change this time, five, but Amelia, Eisen, takes third, and starts for second place up in that high line. Going into turn three right now, still your leader, 15, L.A. Lies, and Shake, five, X, Sander, Coleman, 15, A, Amelia, Eisen, takes the seven of Evan Henriksen. Coleman, they'll close it in on the back bumper of Layla Eisenshake as they go down the back straightaway, going through three and four right now. Takes a look to the inside. Doesn't have enough to make the move. Starting to set up for a pass attempt here very soon. Let's see. Layla Eisenshake, though, still your leader, 15L. Close battle up front now. 5X, but Coleman gets underneath. They get together a little bit, and on the high side out there, Amelia Eisenshake gets a... Good run around the outside, but not feature race though. Who's it gonna be as? We're waiting for a restart. Going a little too fast under caution, so we're gonna make him wait a little bit. We want him lined up tight. Green, green, green. It's Coleman out front in 5X. The 15 L of Layla Eisenshake got around the 7 of Evan Henriksen. And now it looks like it's going to be a three-card battle for the lead of the lap. They're starting to wind down. Amelia Eisenshake in second place. Layla Eisenshake takes a look underneath. They come out of turn four right now. Door to door. Layla gets by. It's the 15 L. Sander Coleman trying to hold him off right now. Layla takes a look underneath. Got a little loose. That opens the door for the 15 of Amelia Eisenshank to jump right next to her. White flag coming out. One more lap to go. Who's it going to be? Sanders Holman goes into turn number one, comes out of turn number two. He's got the sisters right behind him, but he'll hold them off. 5X, Xander Coleman, your winner. Just barely, though, as Layla Eisenshank got second place in the 15 e of Amelia Eisenshank. And the 7 of Evan Henriksen rounding out your, your field. Ladies and gentlemen, and everyone in the audience out there, clap your hands, make some noise, stomp your feet, high five, scream and yell, honk your horns and tailgating, give it up for your winner and rookie one, 5X, Xander Coleman. Charging down the back straightaway in the lead in three. The Gravedigger Special got a little bit loose coming out of turn number four, and that allows the 34 of Vince Noble to catch right back up. Roll off Anderson ride. And that's the eight of Lexi Bronke, the 12 of Kazed, the 15 of Jacobson, the seven of Mao, and the 29 of Olsen. We complete yet another lap. Noble took a look that time inside the three as the three slides up. There will be door to door going down the front stretch. They're hooked together going into turn number one. They get three. And the three of Jordan Dahl will continue to be a leader. The eight of Lexi Promke moved up into second place after that little skirmish. 
And in single filed out right now, your leader is the three of Yordahl, the eight of Lexi Bromke in second place, 34. Vince Snow will get a 12. Peyton Pazet, 15. Andre Jacobson, seven of Simon Mao, and the 29, Emma Macy Olsen. Getting a little crazy towards the back right now, Simon Mao way up high. Also going up high, the three of Yordahl, and that's gonna open the door for the eight. Three cart going up in the high stuff, spinning around. Off. Caution will come out. Green light go back racing. Lexi from here later. As the 34 of Vince Noble taking a look to the inside as they go to turn number three right now. Your new leader will be the 34 of Vince Noble. Contact towards the back out there between the 7 and the 15. Everyone stays straight, we stay green, flag racing. Lexi Bromke charges back now at the back of the 34 of Vince Noble, your new leader. Noble got loose in turn number one. Was able to make the same and stay in the lead. White flag out, one more lap to go for Vince Noble. Gets loose again, coming out the corner. And now Caden Gazette in the 12 cart. Take a look at it. Lexi Bromke gets back up to second place. They're fighting real hard out there for position. Around goes the seven of Simon Mao, but your winner, 34, marking it. That is Vince Noble. And that's the eight, Alexi Fromke, 12, Caden Kazette, 15, Andrea Jacobson, 29, M. Macy Olsen, the three of Blake Bjorndahl, and the seven of Simon Mao. Sparks coming out of the back of the 34 out there. Perfect time, I guess, right as he takes the checkered flag. Taking a look right now to see what was going on. Like something underneath. Nothing serious out of the 34, but ladies and gentlemen, he's going to come out and do his victory lap. Scoring the victory. In your novice two class, let's hear it for 34. The Snowball. Green for looking for green. There it is, green, green, green. They're door to door going into turn three right now. Aggressive end speaker. Still door to door right now for the lead. Great battle out there, bouncing off each other a little bit. Give and take going, but now your leader this time by will be the 19 of Aggressive. It's underneath a little bit of contact out there in the flying dudes. Your leader continues to be the 19 of Grand Set. He's the flying dudes of Ashton Speaker right next to him. Then it's the 21 of Brayden Nygaard and the 18 of Tate Magnuson. A little bit of contact out there once again. Speaker got all up on that back bumper. And there's 19 of Grand Set. Grand Set holds on. We stay green flag racing. He stays in the lead. Laps starting to wind down right now. Can Speaker put on an offensive? Speaker coming off the corner a little bit higher out there, trying to gain a little bit of momentum. Right, that's Speaker down low in the 19. Charging into turn three and four, a little bit of contact out there. Speaker gets underneath the 19 and rest that and holds up front a little bit. They're still a little bit door to door though, going into three. Speaker slides up. Griffith charges underneath out there. Almost a slide job city battle out there. The 19 of Cole Gressup continues to be your leader though. 19 or the two of Blind Deuce. Ashton Speaker putting on a great show also in second place. White flag out. One more lap to go. Can Cole Gressup hold on? Going through through turns number three right now. Coming out of four. Your winner, Cole Gressup. That's the Blind Deuce of Ashton Speaker, the 21 of Brayden Nygaard, and the 18 of Tate Magnuson. Your rookie two feature race winners. Excellent race put on by uh, everyone out there.
Only one card could win, though. As he does his victory lap, everybody clap your hands, make some noise. Honk your horns and tailgate. Ooh, let's hear it for the 19, a cold dress at. There it is, green light go. Colby Olsen charges to the lead in 11. That is the 10K at Jacob Crogro and the 29 Ryan Brassett. Olsen continues to lead in 11, stretching that lead out. He goes into turn three and comes out of turn four, completing yet another lap. It's Olsen, Crogro, and Brassett. advantage over the 10K of Jacob Crocker. And Ryan Brass has third place in the 29. Olsen looking strong up front over half a straightaway lead, almost half a lap lead. Sliding up high was the 10K of Jacob Crogro that time by then Brian Brass up in 29, second and third place. Looking a little tight out there in the 10K. Right flag one more time around for the 11 of Kobe Olsen. As he comes out of turn four right now, here is your winner, 11, Kobe Olsen. And it'll be the 10K, Jacob Crogro, the 29 Orion Brassett. Your 206 class. As he comes around doing his victory lap, everybody make some noise, clap your hands, scream and yell, hop your horse and tailgating for number 11, Colby Olsen. Continues to be the Red Rocket number four, Ethan Moore. comes around and does his victory lap out there. Let's hear it for the Red Rocket, number four, Ethan Moore. Let's 
Trevick. You're open at Old Glass. Ten laps, and we get to watch every one of them. We're the lucky ones. We're the lucky ones. Green light coming up. There it is. in the lead. He's been strong all day, but he's got the 34 and Gerald Noble right behind him. Michael Olsen getting roughed up out there. In third place right now. Then it's the 76 of Scott Saylor and the 11 of Galen Seven. Gentlemen, coming around to do his victory lap right now, number 14T. Let's hear it for him. Clap your hands, snap your feet, honk your horse and tailgating. Apparently his cart died, so he's gonna do the victory lap all out of the Stevenator. Hey, he can hear you, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hear it for 14T, Tim Eskinson. Final class out there, 206 Blues, starting on the pole, P1, Brody Carlsford, outside 72, Ty Wilkie. Then it's the 6 of Colton Everett, the 5 of Tony Brasseth, Toby Brasseth in row 2, and then Gwen Saylor and Pete Frumpke. Your final set of green flags go on our final feature race of the evening. They're door-to-door, and door-to-door, and door-to-door. -door. They come to the line, too close for me to call. B1 Brody Carl's Rizzo starts to move ahead a little bit. Three wide for th second, third, and fourth place right now. Keaton Frosty dives for the inside. Wilkie makes a diamond cutter out there. Awesome move by the 72. As now contacted around and tons got yard sale over in turn four. Did you be your leader in B1? That's the six of Colton Everett. 88 Keaton Frosty, 72 Ty Wilkie. 76 Quinn Sailor and five Toby Brasson as we go back to Eli Racing. Rocky looking good in that 88 right now. Charges to the inside and down to the infield. Run down there. Problems on the six car to Everett. Body damage out there. He's to the infield. And it looks like his night is unfortunately over with. Your new leader though, Keaton Frankie at 88. And it's going to be one of Jordan Carlos, who's 72 and high. Wilkie 76, Gwen Saylor in the five of Toby Brassett. No change that time by Keaton Frumpke, looking strong up front. Brody Carlson with B1 trying his hardest to catch up to him. We got a battle at the back of the pack with the 76 of Gwen Saylor and the 5 of Toby Brasseth. Brasseth on the high side, Saylor low. Giving each other plenty of room out there and running real nice and good. Uh, door to door out there for fourth place. Brasseth pulls ahead a little bit but gets loose coming off. Gwen Saylor. Hard in 76. White flag out. One more lap to go. Come 
come into the line this time as he comes out of turn four. Your winner, 88, Keaton Fromke. B1, Brody Carlsford in second place. 72, Ty Wilkie in third place. The five with Toby Brasseth in fourth. And the 76, Gwen Saylor. Running out your field. But folks, we appreciate you all sticking around all night tonight, even during the rain delay. While you're still here, though, give it up for your winner. Your 206 Riverside Class, number 88, Keaton Frosty. But we'll be doing this again on Monday at 7 o'clock. Have a safe trip home, everybody. Good night. And don't forget.